do you um do you want to be my partner for the biology project? I'm sorry, I know you've probably been asked like a thousand times, but thanks for saying yeah to me. I mean, I just figured it could be so easy because we have to make a perfect specimen. So if I pair up with you and you're the perfect specimen and you're already made, we can both just get out of here and like we could do something fun. make an imperfect specimen out of a perfect one? Or perfect specimen out of an imperfect one? Damn. That's gonna be hard. Because I don't think you can... This would be a lot of work to turn perfect. Yeah, no, I agree. But it's also gonna be really hard to, to make you not perfect. No one told me bio would be this hard. Well, I'm glad they're adding all of this stuff to our, you know, machinery and breakdown. You know, like, even yesterday, people in the world didn't know that we could alter our chemistry by, uh, like, in little buns and stuff. And now we do. How crazy is that? So I guess I'm taking this class and getting a degree for a reason, huh? Okay, well, I can totally do all the work if you just want to be the test subject. I know that. We have to reset afterwards, so you'll go back to being perfect. But I think if you made me perfect, and I went back to being, well, me, it'd be a little disappointing. Yeah, so maybe you can see what you'd be like if you weren't absolutely perfect. That would be kind of cool. Might make me feel better about myself. <laughs> yeah, well, anyway, you need an A, so I'm ready to work if you are. Cool. Yeah, no. I just need these for far away, but I'm gonna get up real close to you, is that okay? Cool. Um, I think we have to take a before and after shot. Is that cool? Okay. Yeah. Nothing, nothing crazy. I'll just... I was gonna say smile, but like you just look good doing that, so... <laughs> Ready? Three, two... Okay, thanks. Take a couple. I'm gonna ruin this, but uh, I guess I'll look in your software and we can kind of see. Um, I'm gonna take some notes before, or I guess each step, like what I do, you know, for the lab. You know, I'm even though we can't get kind of an easy off with the project because. I still have to work on you. Um, I'm glad that you chose to be my partner. I know everyone's probably asked you. No one's asked you? Well, I'm happy I died then. <laughs> I think everyone's probably just intimidated by you. Because, you know, you're perfect. But, yay! I think everyone wanted to get to know you a little bit more. And what's a better way to get to know you than look through your hard drive? Alright, I'm sorry. I'm rambling. Let's um, get into it, shall we? Can you, um, can you tell me your password? I know, I guess that's kind of why you have to pick people you trust, but I promise I won't use it for any other purposes other than this lab. Okay. Okay. Ready? Okay. Oh, uh, wait. Was that a seven or six? <laughs> My bad. My bad. Maybe we should have worked on me so I could have better hearing. Okay, awesome. I'm in. Wow, there's a lot here. It's kind of different when we watch it in the videos and stuff, you know? Like, it looks easy and then I see it all right in front of me. It's like, whew. Even your interior is pretty. I didn't mean that in a weird way. I'm so sorry. Just, you know. My first time seeing hardware in person, you know, <laughs> hardware in person, you get it, because the hardware in it. Is. Anyway, <laughs> um, alright, uh, what should we start with? Well, first let's, um, I don't know, we should mess up your face, because that's like the most perfect part about you. Um, 
Again, let me take some notes. So we're gonna start with face naturally. I have to change everything. <laughs> um, do you wanna start with eyes maybe? Yeah, you have really big, pretty, bright eyes. So why don't we dull those a little bit, make them a little smaller, a little bit like more eerie and squinty. Yeah, I think I would like, yeah, bring you down a couple notches. Okay, let me find the setting. anything up. It's still part of the project, I guess. <laughs> um, okay, let's go back to the main system. Okay, what should we do now? Also, your lips, too big, too full, too bright. Gotta change that. Um, I don't know if this is tingling, is it? You feel okay? Is it tingling? Is it tingling your senses? Um, okay, let's do lips. Mm. Okay, we're going to take away the cupid's bow. I'm gonna make your lips smaller. Okay, just. Ooh, that's a little too small, you know? Okay, perfect, perfect, perfect. Okay. Hmm. I'm gonna make a note of that. So, smaller lips, smaller eyes. <sighs> you still look pretty dang perfect. I know this is gonna be this much work, but that's okay. I got it. I'm not an AP student for nothing. What else can we mess up? What about your ears? We'll make your ears like slightly bigger, maybe? Yeah, because they're like, you have perfect little, nice ears. <sighs> yeah, so maybe we should make those bigger. Um, let me find that setting. Go back a little bit. Mm. Ears, ears. Um, yes. Okay, well, why are there so many options for ears? You can take away ears. Well, I want you to be able to hear me. Hmm. Take away one ear? I don't know. Um, let's just make them bigger. Yeah, or I could just turn off your hearing. Well, that would be the same as taking away your ears. Yeah, bigger it is. Okay, ready? Yeah, that's definitely, I mean, you still rock them though. Your piercings look great. Uh, I'll make them a little smaller. No, I don't want your hearing to be too sensitive. Okay, ready? I'm gonna lock that in. Okay. Big ears. But you know, I always thought Dumbo was really cute, so. Alright, what else can we do? What else can we do to you? Um, what about your nose? You've got a cute little button nose. Maybe we should fix that. Um, I think that we could even, like, just instead of fixing your nose at all or, like, messing it up, because I don't see how we would mess it up, I think all noses are really beautiful, but maybe we could just, like, totally shift it to one side, so like this point is touching way over here. 
Yeah, because if we did anything to the shape of it, it's still gonna look good on you. I think maybe we should just like totally like flatten it to your face. I mean, you would still look good, but it would be less perfect, you know what I mean? Yeah, let's try that. I'll see if I can find that. Okay, back again. Okay, and we're finding nips. I think that's the way at the top. Oh my god, I should have read the manual better. Ah, there it is. Okay. Um. that did not do the flat thing that kind of sent it into your skull a little bit and that's kind of that kind of works right does it feel uncomfortable at all no okay well then we've got it i didn't realize it did that but I, in the notes i'm gonna say i did that on purpose <laughs> how do you how would you say that it like went back into your face a little bit yeah, oh, okay. <laughs> Only you could rock that. Only you could rock that. Okay, well, we still got some work to do. We still got some work to do. Let's see. Um, can I put on your height? Yeah. And I don't think that making you any taller or shorter would mess you up at all. Like, I think you could still be perfect. But maybe I'll make like one part of you longer and one part of you shorter so it's like less symmetrical. I know that's not really height, but that would be under height setting, right? There's a limb setting. I guess that makes sense because you can make some of your limbs longer. Okay, we're gonna figure this out together. Actually, you just sit there and look awesome and I'll fix it. <laughs> or I guess I'm it up? Yeah, because you're already rambling. Okay, let's see. Okay, I'm at limbs. Oh, perfect. So this one's just one side of your body, and this is the other. I'm going to make this longer. <laughs> Are you feeling okay? Okay, cool. Just, I'm glad you're sitting. And then I'm going to make that arm shorter. And then this one, I'm going to make your leg shorter. And your arm longer. Hmm. You're still... Still okay? Okay. Let me make those adjustments. Limb. Adjustments. Alrighty. Hmm. What else can I do to you? Do you want, like, a cool scar? I mean, it wouldn't look bad on you, but it's still considered like an imperfection. I think there's something in there somewhere. Yeah, you could be like a cool like Harry Potter-esque battle. I don't know. I think scars are kind of hot, personally. But I'm into imperfect people some of the time. I mean, if you ask any of my friends, that's my type. So, but then I also like you, so. Oh, please, like it's a secret. I copy you every day in class, so come on. And so does everybody else, so I guess we don't really know. Anyway, yeah, but you know, you're cute. <laughs> Let's get on with it, shall we? Maybe this will help me kill my crush. Must. You returned it. No, helpful thinking. It's okay. It's okay. 
I'm not hurt. Alright, what were we gonna do? Oh, scars. Yep. Let's see. No, I know exactly how to get here. I paid a lot of attention to this one. Okay, what kind of scar do you want? And I would put on your face. I think there's even like a hand drawn mechanism so I can do like literally whatever. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Um, yeah, I'll do one like on your cheek right here. And I'll just do like a little slash. Yeah. Yeah, that okay. would be kinda cool. Alright, I promise it's not gonna hurt. It's just gonna be for like dramatic effect. Like theater art, you know what I mean? Ready? That looks so real. That's crazy. Wow. Impressive. Can't say that. I've done that before, but it was easier than I thought it would be. Okay. Alright. Let me mark that down. Scar on cheek. I kind of wish that part wouldn't go away. I like it there. Anyway. Okay, we're gonna go back, back, back. And What do we want to do now? I guess I could just look at the menu. What is here? Mm, no, nothing there that I want. Ooh, okay. That's kind of cool. Do you want to like invert? the contours and like the bright parts of your face yeah so like the parts of your face that are supposed to be a little bit darker even without makeup just like where the light hits do you want to like invert it that could be kind of cool that could be kind of cool like this part would be pretty dark and then like these shadowy parts would be kind of light yeah it would be like somebody just like switched the view up on you yeah i like that let's try it i've never done something like that gonna switch those off. Wow. You look cool. Yeah, no, you look like you could be in like an anime or something. In a good way. God, I'm still seriously making you imperfect. And I guess it's technically imperfect, but can't make you not hot. So that's kind of crazy. Alright, inverted coloring. Alright, let's mess up your eyesight, shall we? I know you can't really mess up your hearing because we have to be talking as a group and I need your consent for everything. I can kind of mess up your eyesight. As you can see, mine's already pretty messed up. But... Alright, let's... Okay, let's find eyes. change the color. Okay, mm, what color? We said yellow or orange or something like that. Okay. Cool. You kind of look like a cat. <laughs> you know how the cats have like the glowy eyes? Um, you know what I mean. And then we're gonna make your eyesight a little bit worse. I'm gonna go back one. Click there, there, and deuce. I say, can you see me? Not at all. Okay, I'll put it up just a little. Can you see me? Let's get together. Let me, let me make that note. Third vision. Did you have 2020 before? Of course you did. Alright, um, let's fry your hair a little bit. Yeah, 
like, you know how when people put a lot of heat on their hair, it looks kind of like, mm, yeah, I think that we should, um, like, m totally mess it up. Yeah, again, turned in the color and everything, I don't think that would be, like, considered imperfect. Just a difference in expression. But, uh, my hair is pretty fried, and I do cut it myself, so. Oh, I do think we need a sample of your hair first to, like, compare. Is that cool? I'll just cut out, like, a little. Yeah, there's, like, well, I'll just get it from the station. Yeah, some of these things that we're supposed to be checking. Yeah, I could check your eyesight afterwards to make sure that your vision is really as bad as it's supposed to be for the test. Okay, can I just get a little clip of your hair? Hold still. Okay, cool. Just need it like before and after maybe. I'll finish up your hair and then we'll go back to the vision. from the same side. Well, now your hair is even. I cut a little bit of the front side, a little bit of the healthier side, so now I'm just, I'm just gonna leave it. Alright, let me check your vision. Can you look right here? I'm gonna make sure your pupils do everything they're supposed to and you can follow directions. Okay, remember, follow this light. Yeah, no, I really did mess it up. Go us. <laughs> um, I'll probably check it back when you have perfect vision and it'll be crystal clear. So I just want to make sure everything goes back to normal, yeah. <laughs> okay. Alright, let's do maybe one or two more things. There's not really much I can do to make you less perfect. But, um, ooh, I wonder if we can give you a little bit of like a sunburn. Huh? But again, attractive and imperfect. I don't know. I have to look back in the manual to see what counts as what. Because you can still look attractive and be imperfect. Like this, come on, you know. Mm. Well, I'll try the sunburn anyway. I mean, we've clearly seen that things don't actually hurt, like the scars, so you should be fine. If not, I've outlined my back. <laughs> I'm kidding, but hopefully it doesn't cause any problems. Okay, let's go to skin. And toggle on sunburn.
Don't worry, I'll type all this up later so it's not like it's a crippling mess. Well, actually, I have a nice report going on. Cool. Um, Alright, let's go back to the main menu. Um, anything else you think we need? Anything that feels too perfect to me right now? Hmm. Wouldn't want to like restrict airways or anything like that. I already kind of did your eyesight. Maybe your lashes. Your lashes still look really good. Even though we made your eyes small, it's still like your lashes are still very good. We could do that. Yeah. Okay. Let me go back to the eyes. Um, okay. Sorry, it's on a totally different page. I was gonna have to change your eye color again. And lashes, lashes. Okay. I'm going to. Gosh, all these are supposed to make them look better. Where's the one to make them go away? Uh, oh. None. Wait, you need some, or like stuff's gonna get in your eyes. Hold on. Let's. We just have a little bit of that eyelash. Yeah, we don't want fuzz getting in your eyes, so we won't take away your eyebrows either. Wow. <laughs> that looks kind of crazy. Okay, well, I feel like we're kind of done. Yeah, I mean, you look imperfect. I say that, but like, I know I'm gonna change you back in like five seconds, and you're still gonna look hot. And great, so all right. Time's almost up for this period, so let me just take a progress picture. You said we did it, and I'll get you all back to normal, okay? Yeah, thanks for letting me do all this. It's kind of like fun, right? Smooth. <laughs> I think that should be like your yearbook photo or something. No, I just think so. <laughs> it still look better than everybody else's. Let me, um get you all reset. We'll do the vision test again to make sure that's there because that's arguably probably the most important thing I changed or the most important thing you still need. Yeah, for the hair you could always wear wigs, ears, earmuffs, you know, we'll figure out the rest but you kind of need your eyes. <laughs> okay, let's back to main menu. Um, we do the bottom and Total reset. Back to normal. Okay, do your eyes feel okay? Yeah, everything looks normal. There was no defects in your system, but I will check your eyes out again. Ready? Just follow me. You got it. We'll do a couple more though. Eyes on the right. Yep. Look at that on the right. But don't look at my finger. Perfect. Make a quick note. What is the time? Okay. That's when we finish. Back to perfection. I'll upload the pictures to the lab report so you can see before and after. Um, or I guess before is the same as the after, but <laughs> we have the before or middle after. Anyway. Awesome. Okay, well, thanks so much for being my lab partner and for being a perfect partner, both in physical appearance and in just your humor and camaraderie and partnership work ethic. Anyways, <laughs> I really do appreciate it and um, I'll see you the next class. Or we could go get poo after school. That sounds fun. <laughs> uh, I think you're the only person that's ever seen me like that, so I appreciate it. You see my imperfections as pretty cool, and I see your perfect as not so intimidating. Makes us a pretty good pair, I think. <laughs> yeah, alright, I'll uh, meet you after, yeah, fourth period. Cool.